You knew there were going to be protests. Gina Haspel is controversial. She was in charge of a secret prison in Thailand when Abdul Al-Rahim al-Nashiri was tortured. But Republicans on the committee across the board said that was actually okay with them. It's very easy to sit back and criticize the work of the agency with the benefit of hindsight. Haspel says she wouldn't torture people now, but Democrats were not convinced. Please answer yes or no. Do you believe in hindsight that those techniques were immoral? Senator, what I believe sitting here today is that I support the higher moral standard we have decided to hold ourselves to. Can you please to. answer the question? Senator, I, I think I've answered the question. No, you've not. She went on to say that she doesn't believe torture works, but with a caveat. She never said what she supervised, waterboarding, was torture. We got valuable information from debriefing of al-Qaeda detainees, and I don't, I don't think it's knowable whether uh, interrogation techniques played a role in that. She had to answer for another controversial move. She sent the order demanding 92 videotapes of people being tortured destroyed. She blamed her boss, and Republicans seemed convinced of her innocence. Would holding you responsible for drafting a cable at your boss's direction make any more sense than holding a Senate speechwriter responsible for the boring speeches senators give on the Senate floor? Senator, I'll defer to you. <laughs> Some have warned giving her the job would send the message that the U.S., like President Trump, is okay with torture. At least one Democrat now says he doesn't agree, making it likely she will be the next leader of the CIA. Patty Colhane, Al Jazeera, Washington.